All right, SimCity 2013. Hey, just trying to do a couple other videos. The some initial startup of uh, a city. Um, I have one before I did with uh, Clearwater, and I'm going to use that same map. Now you can look at that other one. I get a little more detail, but this is maybe this is just a guide and, and just a thought process that I, I created as far as creating, uh, you know, parks and plazas to to, to dictate what residential now real quick real quick green obviously is going to be residential the blue is going to be commercial the purple street is going to be the streetcar avenue and then the orange on this powerpoint slide is going to be the slide uh, going to be like a plaza or nature whether you want to do medium wealth or you want to do triple or high end wealth uh, and and kind of how you put those uh, my strategy in my thought process going into this is just you know that's kind of how I'm going to dictate what what people are living in my city so I'm going to do Norwood Hills so well, here is Norwood Hills and I did the same thing before as from the previous video now what I did is you know I played this city for oh I don't know hour enough where I got everything up and running you know currently before I bulldozed everything I'm making about oh close to seven thousand dollars an hour uh, and on top of that, I'm, I have an oil well that's I'm going to go with. So let's just kind of take a view. I mean, you definitely this is a mountain. Uh, it's not as flat, and you got to make some decisions. Ultimately, what this city I'm going to have for this little three-city you know region is I want this to be mining. I want it to pull this oil out and make money. Um, in addition, I'm going to set aside a good chunk of it to have garbage dumps and some sewage systems that will help the other two cities take care of that plus there's oil and coal under these under the, in them hills uh, so we're gonna probably be a power source as well for the region so, okay but as far as the as the PowerPoint slide and my kind of thought process of just trying to get things and and you know a repeatable pattern here's what I did and some people like this, some people have said okay, but you know, it's just a guide. I'm just kind of fiddling around with it. That's what makes this game so good. Uh, let's, so. All right, so when you walk in and you come in, I got my commercial. I definitely offset that because I don't want a traffic jam coming in. And it's all commercial right in here. Now, the biggest thing about this thing is I play this a few times. It, it's This industry just wants workers. The now the, the buildings want workers. It's tough to find where these guys are going to live, and it's going to get full of air pollution here. So the wind is going left to right. So I have a neighborhood set up here, and it's kind of like the slide. So we have we have yeah, it's not working. We have zone residential, and in the in the middle we have different parks. That's a high-end park right here, and these are all just plat. Uh, these are just nature, medium wealth. Now, as far as the services for this city, I, everything's up and running. I have fire, and police up here on this hill. I have water on the hill. There's a school, just a grade school. That's the only thing in here. Uh, a clinic. This is going to be a hospital because a lot of people get sick in this mining town and they get hurt so I got, an, I got a clinic set aside just for the oil well and this is the oil well right here uh, one thing I did learn I'm, y y you can just extend this road out for this oil well so basically this is one oil well but I have all ten wells working here and uh, you know it's it's shooting out uh, oil <laughs> now uh, as far as the density of this street this main street is a streetcar street and high density streetcar all the way up top of this hill as well as down down in the middle I think that's going to be somewhat of a help traffic move along alright and then the, in the top residential area I have a little commercial once you get to the town hall I put the town hall on top of the this, this hill so we have a little commercial region and then you know a commercial region there is so kind of almost a split and then this upper Thing is the same thing. It's it's a little wavy. It's, I mean, it's a little uneven if you get over here. It's not flat, but you know the simulation kind of messes around with it. So I have parks. Pretty much right now, I have all parks. So doing medium wealth. Uh, 
And then on this side over here, this is the that's got the power, the dump, the sewer, and for the oil I need to ship it out and make some money. I got to do a trade depot. So basically, I'm I'm pretty early into the game, but I, what I wanted to do is just kind of show how this little city landscape looks, and you know, give some people some thoughts. So that maybe they look at it and think, oh, that's good, or they look at it and think, oh, well, that's not very good. But uh, it definitely, you know, it gets people thinking. So what I'm going to do is here, I'm going to unleash this, and uh, we'll see how it how it initially populates, because uh, it was it was making some good money before this. So let's go ahead and let's let's fire this bad boy up. We'll go fast speed, and I'm sure it's going to talk about budget. Oh, yep, there it is, bankrupt in 15 hours. <laughs> Well, let's see where they first start to come into play. Yeah. Before I bulldozed them, there was a couple, you know, apartment buildings in this area. That one right there was an apartment building, so it looks like they're going to do that again. Uh, the streets for right now, I think for the most part, are all just low density. Uh, I may have a few medium right along the the commercial you know just to try and maybe get some traffic but for the most part they're just low all right well they're coming in oh bankrupt in 13 hours huh I'm losing 7500 Good thing is I have a I have a hundred grand, and am selling oil, so I should be fine. Why these things build up? <laughs> All, right. All right. Well, let's in the morning and people are working hard here. <coughs> All right. Well, I keep moving in. I like how the basically is telling you you better fix your stuff. Well, I got some money to hang on to it, so we're only losing fifty five hundred currently, and it's five in the morning, so people get up. Yeah, long term on this thing, I don't know. There's a bunch of ore. Right here in this middle too, or coal. I gotta figure out how, how do I get that money out of the ground without killing people, and making them all sick. By the time I put dumps and sewage, and then put a coal mine right there, it's not gonna be a very clean place to live. But you know, not every city can be clean. Shops are coming in. Kind of the main drag there. And then they roll up the hill. And town Hall. He's fussing about the budget. Uh, it'll take care of itself here, don't worry. And that's going to be the future big old regional hospital. So I'm going to need it. Well... It's interesting that they just go to apartments before they kind of fill out all the little low-end residential stuff. Adopt a rat. Business is good there, apparently. Adopt a rat.
Had a fire. Need some workers. One thing I'm trying to do is playing this, and I'm, you know, weak into this game. It just seems like you can never supply or never calm their need for workers. All these shops need workers. Industry. Oil well. Hope you need work. Yeah, you need to get working and make some money. So, I got 650 people. I'm about ready to break even here. I'm only losing about $1,200 an hour now. Although I have lost about $25,000 in this little experiment, which I think is kind of interesting. Hopefully, just again, it's just interesting to see how this you know works, and this is almost just a kind of a cookie cutter approach here. And eventually, I'll go in here and change, flip these around to see how the high income, high wealth goes, or maybe take them away. And still learning how that odd stuff works, and. Alright, well, let's on cheetah speed. Alright, we are now officially making money. $121. Sweet! So that took about 12 hours of game time to go from a complete empty city with with services provided and a school and all set up just to bulldoze everybody and kick them out. I wonder if they get mad when I do that or whatever. Oh well. They'll live. Well, now they have the same story they can tell their neighbors uh, over there that I did that to there. That's uh, clear wa Clearwater currently. That was the first video I did. So, yeah, they're probably still shaken up after getting bulldozed. <laughs> and uh, the third city is probably going to get bulldozed here too once I get that little bit built up a little bit more. He's just not ready with all the services. But uh, I'll put that on the video as well. So, But this is even a... You know, if you're trying to build in this city and trying to get some ideas of where, where and how to lay out some roads, this will probably help as well. It was, I mean, this was such an expensive road. That guy right there. But, it's worth it. Eventually, what I'm going to, and game plan for this is this is going to be a, a petroleum headquarters. And I'm kind of envisioning that that's going to, I can put that right in this area, or right in this area as well, kind of clean this up, or even possibly, I don't know what kind of land value, if it's tough for people to live next to it, but maybe put it right in, in this area. And then uh, that will make all of these commercials pretty much be like skyscraper commercial buildings once that, I think. You know, then I'll have a, need an oil refinery, which will be somewhere up there. It'll refine it to gas, make some s plastics, and make some fuel that we, once we refine all this oil that's underneath. And, and the other goofy thing, well, not really thing is, this neighborhood right here in the lower s section is actually sitting on a reservoir of oil as well. So I don't know how long this will really last, but I guess if I suck this one dry, I may have to bulldoze everything and kind of maybe move the move the neighborhood, flip it. Maybe. But then they would get air pollution blown on them if they lived over on this side. But well, we'll see. That's another problem for another day. Alrighty. I'll let this roll out just a little bit more. So let's see what these guys are doing. So medium wealth, medium wealth, medium wealth. So they're all medium wealth because that's what those parks are. Medium wealth. 
Where's that one place I had the high wealth right here? Yep, still medium, even though I put some triple high wealth right there, that plaza. Yep. So it looks like, you know, I do, I am controlling how much the land value is in regards to by putting those parks at double wealth. Alrighty, well this is probably good. I mean, I'll let this thing roll. Looks like the industry is waiting for workers, which you know they'll they'll move in eventually here. Um, but no, not not a bad little foundation for beginning of the city. I'll probably make a a video once I get all three of these bad boys up and running. You know, I think the goal is to do a one of those public great works and then uh, maybe move on to another thing. But I'm definitely having fun learning this. this again, this is just some. My initial thoughts of how this thing should go. But anyway, uh, enjoy, and I hope you enjoyed it.